So guys, it's time to run through some names and numeros. Let's get it. Numbers. Uh, we'll give you a couple big names and tell you who will have the bigger numbers mañana, tomorrow. So we're going to do a little Spanglish today. Don't worry. Yeah. Yeah. Stick it with the quarterbacks. Oh, yeah. No problemo. Who gets more passing guards tomorrow, Carson Wentz or Kirk Cousins? Well, you heard me sit here and tell you how, uh, right how, how, how this right Eagles right secondary right is right a little banged up, right? You heard me say that, right? You also heard me say, hey, Kirk, I want you to go out there and do what you got to do. So, hey, I'm taking you. I told you I rock with you, man. I'm not I'm not just throwing shade. <laughs> Kirk, you my boy, man. Yeah. That's my quarterback. I'm taking Kirk Cousins, man. He, he bumped the set. He spiked the yeah. on that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Jeezy, more passing touchdowns in Kansas City. Deshaun Watson or Patty Mahomes? Well, I think what's going to happen is the Chiefs are going to put corners out here. They're going to put safeties here. It's going to be tough to go up the middle. It's tough to go to the outside. You see these Deshaun Watson yes. I love yeah, Deshaun yeah, yeah, Watson yeah. clips. I can, just, I can watch him on mute. I just love how he does this and this and this. I don't even know. I just wanted to do that. Patrick Mahomes, <laughs> that's the guy I'm going with for more touchdowns in this game. Nothing about what you said. <laughs> I didn't want to do that. I just, I really, he looks cool when he does it. Me, not so much. My grab more scrimmage yards. Alvin Kamara who's questionable with an ankle injury. Yeah. That in mind, or Leonard Fournette. Yeah, I I'm going to go Alvin Kamara. I mean, if it this was just straight rushing numbers, sure. maybe you throw Leonard Fournette in there. But, I mean, yeah. this, guy, this guy is so dynamic in the passing game. You have to pick Alvin Kamara. I, mean, I think he, he almost uh, doubles or even triples um, uh, Leonard Fournette's career reception, uh, re receiving yards. So, you got to go with Alvin Kamara. This offense is going to continue to run through him now that Drew Brees is still not there. You know, I, in the preseason, uh, Sean Payton was talking about they wanted Kamara to be who he is. They don't want to ask no. more of it. Because no. the thought was he's going to have to pick up what Mark Ingram's doing, but then the Drew Brees goes down. I mean, you need him to be through. more, and he's doing a fantastic job of this. All right, here's how it works. Now, you get the uh, the anchor leg. Is that what it's called? I think in the, whatever. <laughs> uh, more receiving yards, MJ. Julio Jones or Larry Fitzgerald? I mean, it's like, MJ, do you want a million dollars in diamonds or gold? Either way, I'm a millionaire, right? Whichever one I pick. I'm going to go with Julio Jones. Why? He's due for a big game, guys. He hasn't topped 60 yards since week two. Not like them. And four different players have gone for 100 more yards versus Arizona this season. So you're telling me Julio can't be part of that? Of course he can. Plus, the cards are without cornerback Pat, um, Patrick Peterson, who's serving that last game of his expansion. That's going to help him. And, you know, Julio is Julio. He's a beast. Look oh, at him. Kidding. Man. Like, that's it. Julio Jones. Yeah, that's it. Not that I don't love Larry, because I, I do. But like I said, it's like six in one hand, half a dozen in the other. I'm going to go with him. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> All right, that was good. A win is a win, guys. I'm going to take that one, but yes. that's all Kyle Allen does as well. We'll check in with oh. the 